So, fishing poles pull more melee DPS than normal weapons if you're a caster. This is because fishing skill is treated the same way that weapon skill is in melee combat. Caster classes, which includes priests, mages, and warlocks, have worse melee glancing blow penalties than the other classes, so they deal very, very low melee damage against equal or boss level enemies. I once did a breakdown of a melee warlock's DPS against boss level enemies in Zul'Garub, and he pulled 9 physical DPS as a human wielding a sword, the Zulian Slicer. Against the boss level target dummy on the public test realm, I pulled 32 physical DPS on a priest with no buffs besides the fishing baubles, which pushed my fishing slash weapon skill all the way to 400, making my melee attacks effectively the same as if I were a level 80 attacking a level 63. With such high weapon skill, there were zero misses, zero dodges, zero blocks, but I auto attacked with no baubles, leaving my weapon skill at 325. I saw several misses and parries, so I don't recommend using other imbues such as Flame Tongue. Though keep in mind some imbues are incompatible with fishing poles, such as Frost Oil. Grabbing 200 extra attack power from an NPC's battle shout landed me 42 physical DPS instead of 32, so attack power increases DPS at a rate of 20 to 1. Also, the boss dummy had enough armor to mitigate 23% of my damage, so the base damage is actually going to be closer to whatever is listed on your fishing pole. The Horde have a clear advantage here, gaining 20 higher base melee DPS due to the Horde exclusive weapon Nat Pagel's Extreme Angler FC 5000. With full world buffs against a boss enemy with zero armor, you could probably pull at least 150 physical DPS from your fishing pole alone. All fishing poles attack at the same attack speed, which is 3 giving them perfect synergy with the Shadow Priest's Mind Flay spell, which has a 3 second cast time. As covered in a previous video, channeled spells can be macroed to add melee hits in between casts. This also gives it some bonus utility with Warlocks and their Drain spells, Night Elf Priests and their Star Shards, and Mages with their Arcane Missiles, though the attack speed doesn't line up as nicely. Anyway, I'll definitely be testing fishing poles in TBC Classic, what with the expertise and weapon skill changes, so keep an eye out for that. And as always, go crazy.